Ashtar Shirin, The Liberation of the Human Race? Dear brothers of planet Earth, I am Ashtar Shirin. My joy today is not only due to the fact that I can come here once again to be with you all. My joy is added to the joy of all the galactic brothers around your planet. The victories are happening every day. You may ask, what victories? We see nothing, we know nothing. This is the biggest victory. We can do what we have to do. Without any fanfare, without despair, without any kind of movement on the planet. This is the best tactic. Acting on the lookout. Acting without the enemy noticing, with great caution. Always analyzing before the next step how far you can be hit. And we have achieved just that. The enemy still has some power. But not the power to attack the innocence of the planet. This power they no longer have. Don't judge situations just by what you see. There is a lot of lying and a lot of makeup in everything that is shown. Don't make hasty judgments so that tomorrow you won't regret it. The time is now to trust the light. The light that is 100% implanted on your planet. There is no longer any kind of blockage. The light of the central sun reaches this planet with maximum intensity, releasing, displaying, causing all truths to come out. There is no more hiding, no more deceiving, no more acting in the shadows. Because there are no more shadows, everything is light, and the light reveals everything, exposes everything. How to know something is wrong? Knowing the truth about that fact. Now, you just have to be careful, because the media uses every fact as an incentive to despair, to prove that everything is getting worse every day, the great wisdom is to look at the fact positively. Something bad has been exposed. Be grateful that it has been exposed. Don't vibrate the negative side. Don't vibrate. The action that the media provokes. Vibrate the fact like the light winning. What was hidden was exposed for everyone to be aware of the fact. This is the light at work. It's not evil acting. It's the light. But they insist on showing that this is their world where only evil exists. But if you start to look at each fact through the optics of light, the energy is different. Don't spread anything. Don't comment. See. Thank the light for exposing the fact. Don't judge. Because no one is there to be judged and just forget it. Learn that lesson. Learn the fact shown and be done with it. This is how you will have to act from now on. Because more and more, they will try to show horrifying things bizarre things, just to shock, to increase fear in relation to your world. Your world is moving towards the light. So if each of you doesn't spread the energy that they put in, it doesn't make your world any worse. Your world gets worse because people spread the negative energy they put on, not because the world is the way it is. So it's up to each of you to look. Be grateful for what the light is showing and just forget about it. A right pee it out of your mind and your heart. That does not concern you. That person does not concern you. It will not be you who will judge him. He will be judging himself. Because what he has committed, he will get back. It will not be you who will change that, neither improving nor worsening. Now, you can make your world worse. If you go into that energy, everything is being exposed. There is no longer any way to hide anything. So know how to face each exposed thing. Just understand that there is no way to hide it anymore. There is only light now on the planet. Everything is moving in stride. You will be surprised how everything will happen. Our appearance is already programmed. We no longer depend on the energy of the planet. We have reached the point where we have already established. The day that we will arrive in mass on your planet. How will the human race react? I'm not going to say it will be a reaction, where everyone will clap for us, on the contrary. There will be a lot of attack, there will be a lot of talk. We will do nothing, we will only appear. As a first contact, as you call it, 
one of us will descend to your planet and speak to humanity. We still don't know who it will be, but rest assured, that one fine day you will see us en masse in your skies. And this day is already marked. We no longer depend on your energy. We got to the point where we needed to make this happen. And from there, the entire awakening process of the planet will be triggered. How will it happen? You will see every day. So just wait. Those who wait for this day with love will raise their arms and applaud us, the vast majority will not. So be very careful with your own positions towards others. We don't want you to be attacked, ridiculed. If you want to receive us with love, do it in your heart. Fill your hearts with joy and receive us. Rest assured that we will feel your love, but don't expose yourself. There's no need to expose yourself. Just feel us and we'll feel you. So this is the big news. Don't focus on who gives dates, because the date only the great leaders know and we certainly won't pass it on to you. So don't believe anyone who passes dates. Everyone is here for this. So at any time, we'll just say, reveal yourselves, and all will reveal themselves. It will be simple, fast and easy. Be ready. Those who love us, set your hearts on fire. Because we're coming, those who still doubt, as you say, will pay to see. So just know, you've hit the sweet spot. Is it the perfect spot? No, it's not. Will it be easy? No, it won't. Will it be peaceful? No, it won't. But I can say it never would be. So we need to start. And what we had to do on Earth's surface has already been done. Be ready, not anxious, just ready. For when your skies darken, not because of the lack of light, but because of the size of our ships. You know, the time has come, they are here. And at this moment, all the Galactic Brothers will be clapping for you, because they will have the science and the certainty that at that moment, the process of liberation of the human race begins. Channeled by Anjos Ilas Terapias,